Hey YouTubers, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to show you a fix for the night mode. I'm Sunation and you're watching Futuristic. So let's get started. The newest version of Windows 10 comes with a feature called Night. Some studies has found out that blue light emitting from your desktop tricks your mind to think it is a daytime, so it affects your sleep. Windows has come up with a solution for that, which is they called Night Mode. Let's see to it. As you can see in the setting, the Night Mode it is completely gray out. You can't do anything. You can't set hours. Turn on, turn off, everything is just grayed out. You can see in this setting, here it is also grayed out. So, let me show you a fix for it. Go to the Microsoft Edge, just search for f.lux, and you will see a website here f.lux official site. You just have to click on download. I have already downloaded it, so I'm going to install it. Uh, it's here. Accept output folder. Yes, as you can see, it is asking for a zip code or location so it can search. So it can search for your location and get the knowledge about your sunset and sunrise time in your area. So it provides you with you can see, see that color. Did you see that? You can adjust here, like go warmer and warmer. Nobody likes this farmer, so you can set like this. So this setting will not trick your mind to think it is a daytime, and you can go to sleep in time. You can change it from movie mode, dark mode, God knows what. Change color to halogen, fluorescent, and a lot of things. You can set your early wake time to I wake up at 6.45, uh, maybe 6 a.m. Yeah, I wake up at that time. Working late, you can set this. You can set recommend colors. See, my screen is so warm right now. And this won't trick my mind to think it is a daytime. So I can get to sleep and time alike. It is not particular fix. It is just an alternative for the grayed out night mode. The Microsoft is a bit lazy about it. The OS has already. This update was launched a month ago and no fix yet provided by the Microsoft to its customer. I think Microsoft should provide a fix for it. So the consumer should not go for a third party app while it is built in the Windows only. That's it for this video. If you like the video, please like, subscribe, and share. If you want me to make some other video, comment down in the section below. Let me know. I will work on it and I will try to for now. Bye bye.